What is going on everybody? This is your friend or subscriber, Steve or Mike, and today we are back with another video, and this one is for Battlefront 2, and this is how I install the Battlefront 2 mods. I've been getting a few questions recently on how I've been doing this, so obviously you want to go to your internet explorer or whatever, and now you want to go to StarWarsBattlefront.Filefront.com, or you can just go to Google, and then ty just type in Star Wars Battlefront 2 mods, and then it should come up. Battlefront 2 mods. And then you click on the, the first one. And then you're on the Star Wars Battlefront.Filefront.com website. And now, if you want to download mods for Battlefront 2, or Battlefront, obviously you just look through here and see what you want, but I'll just go with the maps. And now we got a, a bunch of maps to pick from here, right? So we'll just, we'll just, I guess we'll just pick a, a very easy one. We'll just pick the beachhead one and we'll just download that one. Now I'll just, I'm not really going, I'm, I'm going to show you that this works and then obviously you just go through this, download now, and then after those few seconds it's gonna say would you like to save or open that you would want to click save so obviously it tells you how long the video not video <laughs> the mod will take the download so I'm just gonna go back to view downloads and then I'll just wait for that so anyways back back to here just kind of giving you a refresher here so just gotta go to Google and then type in the ba Battlefront 2 mod for Star Wars Battlefront go back two more times I have to and then when you're done with that when the mod is done downloading, you want to go to your documents or whatever. Just open, just open this up, and then go to your C drive. And yes, this is for Windows 7. I should just say this now. Program Files 86 here. I'm not sure if you can read that, but I'll enlarge that for you. So OS C drive. Program Files that Program Files 86. Then you want to scroll down to Lucas Arts. And if you have this on the disk version, it works. I'm not sure for the Steam version. Like for the Steam version, I believe you would have to go to like under Steam, and then you would f pretty much follow the same instructions. So LucasArts, okay, so it's done. It says for me. All right, that's good. But I'm done. I'm not done with this. Star Wars Battlefront 2. Then you want to click Game Data, and then at, then you want to go to Add On. As you can see, I already got a bunch of mods here. So, I, I'll probably launch I'll launch the game, but first I would have to do something here. Alright, so, then, you want to, alright, so it says, I want to view downloads? Yes, I do. I'll, you can X that out if you want to. You want to open the folder, and I have WinRAR, so that's why, that's why uh, it takes a while for me. So now I would just... Either drag that into the folder. Yeah, you want to open this here, except obviously this has to be uh, bigger here. I can just X that out now. I can X that out, and I'll just drag this into my add-on folder. That's all I have to do. And then that's about it. Hold on. All right, there we go. And now what you want to do is drag that three-lettered folder in that ABH, and then you want to launch your Battlefront 2. and obviously you enter the game and then you launch it and then the mod should be there now I have to uh, just make one quick change here hold on be right back yeah then obviously there we go now I'm back then obviously you just let this all launch and then obviously you select that folder there and obviously audio is probably not going to go through but I don't care put a little bit of an audio so you obviously just go to instant action, and then there's your uh, there's your map RS3 Beachhead, and now now I'll launch it here to show you that it works. See RS3 be Beachhead, and obviously the the map is going to load, the mod map will load, and then you just do your gameplay. So I hope I have helped you out, and hold on, I was just gonna show you the units here, not much. So I hope I helped you uh, out with uh, installing mods. For uh, Battlefront 2 or and Battlefront 1, this it, it's basically the same thing, except obviously you run you do a Battlefront 1 file instead, 
and then obviously you download it and then you just do the same thing you just go to your C drive LucasArts whatever your LucasArts and then you go to Battlefront 1 and then you drag your mod in there and I'm not sure if there's a I'm not sure if there's a certain amount of uh, mods you can have but for me it seems to be like 59 even though it was 64 at a point alright so thank you for watching and I will talk to you later peace